Welcome to CES 2025 Lightning Detox, where the world's top innovators share bold ideas shaping the future of tech. Get ready for rapid fire insights that will light up your world with the latest in cutting edge technology and innovation. Stay with us as we tour the booths and bring you even more exciting innovations from CES 2025. And let's keep those lightning strikes going. Hi everyone, uh, this is Bobby Lin from Royal Jet. Uh, it's great to showcase our latest product in hearing aid, the OTC hearing aid with the latest uh, Bluetooth LE technology. This is the smallest uh, OTC hearing aid with a Bluetooth technology you can find on the market. It actually fits in your ear without showing off. And also our night vision goggles was the uh, thermal to help you better identify your object and for security purpose in the dark. Our focus will be uh, continue to focus on the US market and also expand to the Southeast Asia market for our hearing aid and also our night vision products. And also the product is that we will continue to develop with the latest technology in both uh, Bluetooth, hearing aid and also night visions. Relajet is a company that help you see better and hear better. That's our purpose. We help you to see better and hear better. Good morning, my name is Reza Kazerunian. I am president and co-founder of Aleph Semiconductor. This has been a great week for us. We just launched and announced our second generation of ensemble microcontroller and embedded processors suitable for edge AI application, delivering generative AI at the edge with the most optimum power consumption and performance. This is a very recent award that we received from EE Times in Taiwan for the most advanced embedded microcontroller Bluetooth device in the marketplace, capable of running AI at the edge at the lowest power consumption. Aleph, in a period of the last five years, has developed itself into the most advanced and a pioneer in the area of the edge AI controller embedded processors. We will continue to push that envelope. We will stay elite in the marketplace for those products. We will deliver a higher level of performance, capability, and a lower power consumption for the most advanced battery-operated AJI devices at the endpoint. We are the highest performing embedded controllers for AJI battery-operated applications with the most advanced NPU engine on board. Everyone, uh, my name is Mark. We come from the Taiwan. We are the last sales subsidy company. We are s Grail. Uh, last year, we joined the two, 2025 CES. We watched our best partner, Alif. We tagged the MCU AI solution to CS Show. We tagged the very low cost and the best smart parking solution, which is our partner, Jamin. We launched the over a new product in CES. We work with Alif who want to provide a very low power and high performance device AI solution to the market, even apply on the smart city and the smart parking. In SQL and the German, we use the Alif solution to provide a more high efficiency and a very low cost best to market. So hello, I'm Semir Haddad. I'm the Chief Product Officer for MicroEdge, the company that makes everything software-defined. So the coolest thing that we are showing at uh, um, CES uh, this year is first, all the, the application that have uh, developing, that developed by, my, by our customers with our technology, the MicroEdge V. So we have all verticals, smart grid, smart home, wearables, and also uh, industrial. And then uh, the second thing that uh, is very exciting for us at uh, CES is to showcasing our solution for uh, wearables and energy with our V-Wear and V-Energy solutions. So in the next five years, uh, our company will continue to bring uh, a vertical solution as we did with uh, V-Energy, our solution for the smart grid, V-Wear, our solution for wearables. So we'll bring more solutions for the smart home space, for the medical space. We we'll continue to work with partners, bringing algorithmic partners or communication partners. And then we have also planned to expand regionally 
uh, more in Asia, especially in India, where we're starting to have a very good traction. MacroEdge is the company that makes everything software defined by bringing all the cloud native and mobile technology to the IoT space. Hi, my name is uh, Gabriel Lafonwise. What Chongwen the Mingzi is Guy Lafong, and I'm representing uh, CM Works, where I'm business development and partnerships manager. The coolest thing we're promoting here at CS is our specialized EDA tool for electromagnetic simulation. So this tool enables uh, designers of IC and advanced packaging to predict how electromagnetic interactions will work in the physical world. And we our tool is especially powerful for dense and high speed interconnects, such as those required for AI applications. We've been heavily investing in R&D for our product over the last few years, and for the next five years, we want to continue investing in making our tool more accessible, so to better integrate it into existing EDA workflows. And we also want to keep investing in our capacity to handle next-gen technology components and design. Simply put, in one sentence, we offer EDA for the AI era. So we simplify complexity and accelerate groundbreaking tech, and we would love to uh, work on your next-gen technology challenges with you. Hi, I'm Amber from Dotto Tech. At CES this year, we're showcasing Aris Q3 and Q4 series, which are magnetic external SSD with USB 3.2 and 4. Here's the interesting part. Upgrading your iPhone 16 Pro Max from 256GB to 1TB costs $400, but our 1TB Q3 is only about $90 on Amazon. For the next five years, we're focusing on three key areas, including drones, AI PCs, and gaming. Uh, we're excited to be part of this fast edge revolution, and our goal is to develop the memory solutions for these technologies. I would say delight your life. At Auto Tech, we believe happy employees create the best experience for our customers. So our core value is employees first, which fosters a kind workplace for us to grow together, delivering exceptional products and services. My name is Jackie Chen, president of a Rotec Company Limited. The coolest feature this year we show in CS is surrounding radar solutions for commercial vehicles and industrial vehicles. We are going to create a more intelligent sensors like long-range radar and uh, image radars and uh, more AI cameras with a powerful TPU processor inside to create a more reliable uh, camera uh, fusion with the radar and uh, to overcome the adverse weather environment and the low light environment. Realtek is an intelligent sensor solution provider for automotive and industrial applications. The coolest things we are showcasing at CES is a fine designed solution for electrifying vehicles under 50 kW. It infers through our system integration and R&D capability. From hardware to software of a powertrain, vehicle control unit, motor and meter is all in-house developed by Vetro. While currently Veteran has been focusing on electrifying of road or non-commercial vehicles, for the next five years, Veteran will continue to engage in the development of powertrain modules compatible with a variety of applications, including hydrogen, hybrid, SIC, gun, and etc. To the extent we want to connect the prognosis monitoring system and the AI development, we devote our corporate responsibility to establishing a smart city. We are a complete LEV solution provider based in Taiwan to elevate e-mobility. Hi everyone, I'm Mike Su from Carota. I'm the product manager. With this time, we bring our front market and aftermarket solution to the CS. For the front market, we provide for the car OEM, the OTA solution, remote diagnostic and private app store. And for the aftermarket, we bring our total solution for the fleet management system to enhance the driver safety and the product safety. Yeah, for the next five years, right now is an AI-driven era. So for the fleet management and the OTA remote diagnostic, we will integrate more AI function into our solution. Yeah, like our Carota slogan, simple connect, simple life. 
we want to bring our customer and all the driver or the product more safety and convenience. Uh, hello, my name is Lok Wan Kim. I'm the CEO of DBEX. So this year, the DBEX has you know, proposed a lot of you know, applications. We collaborated with you know, global companies like uh, AWS, HP, Dell, Hyundai Moto, you know, LZ, you know, POSCO, Inventec, etc. So we have shown you know, compelling evidences of on-device AI you know, capabilities. So this year, we have showed real, true, innovative technology in the world. Coming two years, we will focus on the LLM AI semiconductors. So we want to support, you know, up to 20 billion parameter LLM with on the five watt power consumption. Uh, everybody can use for handheld devices with the LLM capability. So we are creating for AI for everyone and everywhere. So we want to contribute to, you know, super intelligence civilization by using the own device AI so that we can deploy all AI into the everywhere, everyone can use. My name is Sam Yang and we are from CityPack, Taiwan. We are proud to announce the zero standby power and patent with folding clock, European clock. That brings the consumer and our customer the most competitive products and then also the new inventions and the innovations uh, to the products. We are going to in integrate the AI technology into our production line to give our customer the most competitive price and then the most uh, perfect quality and also a lower the cost and the safety environment. Our brands give the customer the best service, the quality, and the new information and also the customize all for all kind of different type of customers. All right, hi everyone. My name is George Xereas. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Slathera. We're here today to demonstrate the world's first dual mode silicon timing device. Uh, the key applications is space constrained applications such as wearable IoT. The first step in our product roadmap involves the development of Gen 1 dual output silicon timing devices. This is what we're demonstrating today. The second step is our Gen 2 platform that has about 10x improvement in temper temperature stability. And with that, we will be targeting uh, high precision silicon timing devices. Stather is on a mission to accelerate the adoption of silicon timing across the world. Thanks so much for watching. Scan the QR code and stay tuned on Digitimes for more tech insights. I'm your host, Amy McCorder, and we'll see you next time.